take a look at all these logs. This is where all those logs we were seeing in the logging forest are going. And way in the background, if you can see that smoke, that's the wood chip burning power plant of all the remains and the bark they scrape off it. This bridge is so tall, take a look at what we just drove over. Tall enough for all the barges to go underneath. A lot of the logs are coming in on barges. Looks like a lot of the workers in the lumber forest are on strike right there. That's what you saw there. All these ports have logs coming in. Hoping to get a little closer to see some of this stuff going on. That bridge is so massive. So all the ships can get underneath it. Here looks like more workers on strike. Can we turn here? No, we cannot. We can't turn anywhere here. There come some big logs. Oversized load trucks following it. And here comes a wood chip truck that we're gonna be following. I'm used to a bunch of those at home. New England has a lot of wood burning power plants. That's how some of the northern states claim to be over 90% renewable energy. They're burning trees instead of fossil fuels. If you look out the side view camera right now, camera right now, you can see in the distance the wood burning power plant making big plumes of smoke. You can't see it at the moment as well as we could like 20 minutes ago before the fog really started. And now the view isn't as good, but you can still see through the guardrail how many logs there really are. And you're about to see the giant log barge. And there's a bunch of other barges on the other side of the bridge, and I see one coming down the river on the other side. That's really cool seeing a giant log barge. Never seen anything like that. I've seen logging ferries where the trucks go onto them, but nothing like this on that scale. That was really cool to see. Back on the bridge once again, we're still following that empty wood chip truck, which brings chips from other sawmills back and forth to the power plant to be burned as power. We'll probably see a lot more log trucks on the roads. I've seen more log trucks here than I've ever seen in my life. Even Maine doesn't have this many trucks. Plus the trees up here are much bigger than they're logging. Oh, here we go. Really big logs. All right, now I'm gonna pull into this little stop and show you a bigger picture of the area. We're finally getting some good beneficial rain. Right now we're in Oregon, we were in Washington. These are supposed to be very rainy areas. We're finally getting to see some of it. Really oily here. That's the big bridge we just went across. And you can see over here the wood burning power plants. Over in the distance, you can barely see them now compared to 20 minutes ago when I did a loop around. Interesting. It's finally raining. I wish it would have been raining when I was traveling around all Washington's logging roads. But then again, most of the logging roads around here are, are on very steep terrains, so keeping their culverts clear are top priority. They can't neglect them because when they go over the road, the road gets taken out immediately in terrain like this. So I doubt we'd ever be able to make good videos here.
That's so cool. Check out all those wood chips being unloaded from these trucks on the way to their power plants. <laughs> 